Hey everyone, so I decided to, I was humming and hawing over whether or not to do this, but I decided to do a quick what I got for Christmas video, because I know I love watching those um, from the different channels that I follow, and I thought I'd film my own. Um, it was a pretty good Christmas, I think I got everything I asked for and more, some things that I didn't even realize I wanted, so I was pretty happy. Um, I'm going to go through these and show you what I got. Alright, so this is what, oh yeah, our chairs are knocked over so our one and a half year old doesn't climb them, by the way. Um, this is what was in my stocking that my husband put together. Um, it's kind of a standing joke in our house that he never does stockings. Um, he always plans to and then just runs out of time because he's the last minute shopper and so he'll get the big gift but never remembers to do the stocking. <laughs> last year I got a necklace in my stocking so that's fine but this year he actually did a stocking. So the first item was this cup. Um, I can't remember what this style is called with this font but um, I've been seeing it on Pinterest a lot lately but he got me this mug that says go ask your father because his I watch his son quite a bit and he's always asking me for things and if Steve is home, I'll say, go ask your dad. So he thought this was funny um, to get for me. I like mugs and stuff. He also got me a toothbrush and some toothpaste, and he got the sensitive kind because um, I have receding gums, and my uh, teeth can get sore, and my gums can bleed if I don't use sensitive toothpaste. He got me this body wash. It's a Pure Zen Rose body wash. I've obviously used a bit of it. And then this was the final thing in my stocking, which he drove... An hour to buy on Christmas Eve off of Facebook Marketplace but I'm really into metal straws I have regular stainless steel and I have rose gold and I just ordered regular gold and so he got me these unicorn metal straws they're pretty cool so you see they like change color when you move them they're really pretty so there were four bendy ones which are my preferred kind and there are four straight ones I actually bought metal straws to give to quite a few people for Christmas this year because they're just such a practical eco-friendly gift I love them they um they sit still in your drink you know plastic straws kind of float out metal straws don't do that and they get cold as you drink which is really cool so that was my stocking I'm going to move on to my uh larger gifts from him now Okay, so this is the smaller gift that my husband got me. It's a mandolin cutter thing. Um, I still haven't taken it out of the box. I'm not sure when I'll use it, but I'll try to. It's because I was saying that I wanted to make my own french fries because I have an air fryer now. And this has a setting for cutting french fries, so I'll try that at some point. Um, just not sure when. I will do that eventually, but it's been sitting in the cupboard like this so um, as of yet. Or as of now. I don't know. And the big gift he got me were these... I could not believe he actually got them. I've been wanting them for so long, and I suggested if he just wanted to get me one thing, to get me these and buy a used pair or something, but he actually went and bought a brand new pair. So I got really spoiled with these, and I love them. I've been wearing them constantly. Yes, I have shoes on my counter. <laughs> I'll wipe it off when I'm done. But yeah, I was really, really happy about these. Um, okay, I'm going to move on to grandparent gifts. Okay, so from Steve's grandparents, um, they or his grandma got me this fuzzy throw blanket. It's actually pretty cool because the morning before we went to go um, exchange gifts with them, I was saying that our throw blankets are too small because they don't cover me all the way when I'm laying on the couch. I wanted a bigger one. Sure enough, I got a queen sized one. So that's kind of funny, random coincidence. I also got some Christmas Blah, blah, blah. Christmas money. So with that money, I bought this dish set that I really wanted. This is the Pioneer Woman um, Page Blue, I think it's called. I love these. They're so pretty. So it came with four bowls. They're so gorgeous. Although a couple of them have chipped already, unfortunately, but they're still pretty enough that I don't care. <laughs> um, and then there's the lunch plates. They are gorgeous too. I love them. I got rid of a couple sets of plates to make room for them. And then there's the dinner sized one. So these were $60. Um, and then with the rest of my Christmas money from them, I bought, um, what did I buy? I bought some Christmas decorations that were on clearance. So yeah, typical mom stuff. So that was, those were my gifts from Steve's grandparents and from my grandma. So my family has never really celebrated Christmas that much. My parents don't buy gifts. Um, they didn't celebrate it at all growing up. They don't decorate their house. I know it's kind of weird, but they do come for dinner at my house now. Um, my grandparents have never really bought us gifts. Lately, my grandma has been um, doing small handmade things. So this year she made everyone loofahs, which are actually pretty nice. They're kind of this um, scratchy sort of material. So they're very exfoliating. I've used it a lot and I really like that one. 
So yeah, those were my gifts from grandparents. I almost forgot to add this on. So um, I also got a winner's gift card from Steve's grandparents. So I got a message board and I also bought a pair of shoes for Isla with it. <laughs> you know, mom life, but I got this message board and it came with a bunch of letters and you can just put different quotes on it. I've seen these a lot on Instagram and Pinterest. So I really wanted one and I found one there. Um, yeah, it's got a quote for Isla's birthday right now. Um, birthday, nature's way of telling us to eat cake. <laughs> so yeah, I'm just going to change it up probably once a week or so, but. So I have been wanting this diffuser for so long. Oh, I can't remember. Oh, Dewdrop, I think it's called maybe. I don't know. It's the Young Living diffuser. So I am with Young Living. I make an order every month. I don't sell to other people. I just order for myself. My mother-in-law is the one who got me into Young Living and she got me this diffuser for Christmas. I absolutely love it. It's beautiful. It has this bronzy gold touch here and here and there's different light settings. Um, it's a lot bigger than the one I had before. So my smaller diffuser goes in the kids' rooms now um, as needed. And there's adjustable light settings, multicolored, orange, red, uh, what else? Yeah, orange again, green, I think it goes to blue. Yeah, there's purple, blue, very pretty. I typically just leave it on the light setting or that one. Yeah, and it came with two oils. So there's Citrus Fresh, which is a blend. I think it has like orange, tangerine, lemon, a couple other things in there. And a lavender, these are both five mil. So that was my gift from Steve's mom. And then my sister's, um, so we do a kind of secret Santa, a not so secret Santa, if you will. Um, so because there's seven kids in our family and we don't usually buy for our older brother because he lives, um, he lives about 15 hours away and he doesn't really participate in gifts. So um, we just do a draw at Thanksgiving so that each of us buys for just one person out of the four older siblings. And then the younger two, we still buy full on gifts for. So, um, my 19, 17, whoa, no, my 19 year old sister drew me this year and she asked me what I wanted. And I said, I wanted the swell white gold water bottle, which was on Indigo. And I guess they sold out right before she went to look for it. And so instead she got me this champagne gold water bottle from swell. These are really nice. I really like putting a drop of orange essential oil in it. The edible ones that are safe to do this with. And our, the limit for the limit money wise for gifts was $60 or it usually is. We might be upping it this next year, but normally it's about 60. So she got me this water bottle and she also bought me a bottle of wine, which is obviously gone because I received that on Christmas day. <laughs> I just haven't taken out my recycling yet. And then my youngest sister decided this year, she's going to buy gifts for everyone. So she, um, went and bought everyone in our family a gift, which was really nice, or at least all the siblings. And she got me this hard candy. This is my 16 year old sister. So she got me this hard candy makeup set. Um, came with this bag. Inside is this lip plumping serum. I actually really like this. It's a nice neutral color, just did a bit. It came with this setting spray, which is also fairly nice. Hard candy is a good, like, um, budget friendly makeup brand if you want to like, get started with your collection. I have quite a few things from them and like them. It came with an eyeshadow primer, which I haven't tried yet. It came with this matte lipstick, um, which I'm excited to try. It's just a little darker than I wear normally. I love matte lipsticks though. And then it came with this little, it says bronzer, but it's really more of a highlighter. It's a little too glittery for me to wear that much, but I do wear it. I've worn it a couple times. And I came with this eyeshadow palette, which has a couple nice colors in it. I also came with this, um, I think this is a baked eyeshadow. Let me just check. No, baked highlighter, but it was broken, so I haven't used it yet. Yeah, so that is everything that I got for Christmas. Um, link, if you made a what I got for Christmas video, link it below in the comments. Yeah, thanks so much for watching.